It's me birthday. We out here playing some Mario Kart. Chips and queso. Chips and queso and Chardonnay. We're really, really living it up. Also, I actually did my makeup today, so. I keep losing because I'm bad at Mario Kart. There's both of us because we fucking lost. <laughs> that shit's sad. So at this point, we just watched a little bit of Food Network and then we went to bed. The next day, we woke up and went shopping and then we went to the planetarium, which was so much fun and it was so cool. Like, look at this. That was on the ceiling. Isn't that insane? It looks real. Smile. They even put some gay shit up. They knew we were coming. This is Carl, the star projector that is now defunct. But we walked around a little bit more and then off we went. This is a super cool store called Record Archive. They have so many records and just like kitschy, cool stuff. And then we went to Living Roots, my absolute favorite wine bar in Rochester. As you can see, I was very excited to drink some Prosecco. Went to dinner, which was super fun. I was already drunk by the time we got to dinner, which is just the way to be on your birthday. Murder? No! <laughs> Change murder? So I feel like I need to explain. There's this little chalkboard that says before I die I want to with a bunch of stuff uh, right by where we went to dinner. So we decided to go over there. Matthew couldn't spell bourgeoisie, which I think is hilarious. Full ride to law school can't spell bourgeoisie. Nope, that looks so bad, wow. So How old do you think I muted this part when Brianne's writing because me and Matthew were still arguing about him not knowing how old I am. We stand. What does that mean? Um, it's just like a thing that people say like when they're like a big fan of something like I left the sound on in this clip because Margo is making her really cute pig noises But I sound really annoying. So sorry, but we're doing it for Margo. Margo! Hi! Hi, man! Margo, can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? <laughs> so we went to see Margo, which was amazing. Also my brother's apartment, but mainly Margo because she's adorable and I love her so much. It was a much needed thing to do on my birthday before we went out to a bar. Gotta see the pupper. And then we went to this really cute place called Radio Social with my best friends from home. And it was amazing. We got pictures and we played skee ball, which I was surprisingly kind of okay at. We played some Pac-Man, we played shuffleboard like the old people that we are. And then we got to go bowling, which was so much fun and so extremely chaotic when you're all getting increasingly more drunk. All of us were terrible at it and just by the end we're chanting gutter ball, which, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, go Brittany, woo! I honestly don't know what's going on in this clip. I really don't know. And here's some more of that wonderful, I don't know why it took so many videos of us bowling, probably because I was drunk footage.
after all of us failed horribly, Brienne won by a lot, and then we went home. One kid is here and the other is gripping her thigh, the light up is flipping it high. Haha, <laughs> 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 just kidding, we went to see Margot because we were drunk and needed a dog. Baby, I love you. I love you. And then we went home and we ended the night with some good music and just went straight to the bed. <laughs> so thanks to everyone who hung out with me on my birthday and made it literally the best birthday yet. I uh, can say that until at least next year. <laughs> Bye guys, thanks for watching.